previous week was our waste week 2016 and we had a competition of who could recycle the most. Then we created posters of different ways we could recycle. We also made an art project of different recycled materials and saw what different classes come up with. Obviously there were a number of activities that have been planned for Eco Week and um, our cl class participated quite enthusiastically. The running theme this term has been Africa. So going with that theme, we decided to use um, different recycled materials to make Af African spears and African inspired canvas prints. So we also made bee houses and we all pulled together as a school and we sat in the garden and made a lovely bee house which we put in our sensory garden. On Wednesday was our biggest challenge. We actually did a no paper day, which was really difficult. I think more for us as staff than students. Students cut really well with it, but we struggled. It was so hard. But that was a really successful day. I think the main one, because our class seems to do a lot of printing, a lot of our students love to have uh, a lot of just pictures printed out and different things. So we're trying really hard to limit our printing, limit our paper use, and make sure that we're recycling the paper that we are using. So we got a green bag and we're going through the rubbish and making sure that even if accidentally we're throwing things away that it's getting put in the right uh, recycling bags. Generally as a school we're trying to become more eco-responsible. So it's teaching children um, to kind of not waste things like water, um, try um, participate in activities like planting trees, um, recycling on a regular basis, upcycling. Obviously outside we have, um, we, have our, we have our herb gardens and we have our sensory gardens where the students go out on a weekly basis um, to participate in plants and different things. We're going to make more of a conscious effort to do things like switch off taps and lights. Um, in the canteen we can start putting our food into the food waste bin and just little things that like will make a massive difference. I think it's really important uh, with Eco Week that um, that the kids know exactly why like why we're doing it because obviously the environment is such a big issue and it's so important to look after it. So we need to let them know how uh, and why we're doing it. And it was really nice with uh, the assembly because you get to see how every other class sort of echoed those those uh, themes and they're stressing those points to the, to the children and the children really could have a kind of tangible uh, example of how these uh, efforts pay off. So that was really, really nice.